Thousands of people in three of Australia's states were asked to evacuate their homes on Friday after two days of incessant rain triggered flash floods in the country's southeast. The flooding has been the worst in the state of Victoria so far, with southern New South Wales and the northern part of the island state of Tasmania also witnessing incessant rain. Some areas have had rain for more than a month since Wednesday, according to officials as quoted by MSN News, Saturday, October 15, 2022. This has caused massive widespread flooding, with several rivers experiencing record flooding and these will only continue to move downstream and get worse. Images on social media showed people wading through knee-deep water with their pets while others were rescued aboard boats. Meanwhile, the ground floor of a pub on Melbourne's Maribyrnong River was almost completely underwater on Friday morning. This is not Australia's first major flood crisis this year. A severe storm along the country's east coast caused flooding in March this year, which devastated parts of Queensland and New South Wales and claimed more than 20 lives. In July, tens of thousands of residents in Sydney were asked to evacuate due to flooding. Weather experts attribute it to a multi-year La Nina, a weather phenomenon that brings more rain. Several rivers in Victoria, including the Maribyrnong in Melbourne's west and the Goulburn further north, reached severe flood levels with rainwater bursting over the banks. Flood levels, which are near record highs, are expected on Friday evening in the towns of Shepparton and Murchison, north of Melbourne.